What up guys, it's your man with the plan, Barley! What's up? And in today's video, I actually got the next episode of Cooking with Riley. And today, I don't really know what to call this, but I'm gonna make some bomb ass food. Let's just say that. But I got ramen noodles I'm gonna be good cooked. I'm going to fry some hot dogs. I'm gonna chop them up into little bitty pieces. Fry them on the skillet. Um, I got these canned carrots that will also be fried on a skillet. Um, throw some hot sauce in there for flavor. And we're just going to see how this comes out. So, um, welcome to the next episode of Cooking with Riley. Where I change the game on cooking food. Do different, do stuff differently. Um, the whole reason I wanted to start this series is because... Yeah, I've started cooking and stuff. By the way, I'm cooking on a hot plate over here. Um, this is my setup. Don't don't mind the mess. This is my setup. We got a pan for the ramen noodles. We got a skillet. Um, See so yeah, ya, guys. I'm going to use, use the uh, hot plate first. It's kind of messy, like, um, like I said. Yeah, but... Uh, um, and I also have a Coleman that will be used in a later uh, episode, maybe sometime soon. I've did some cool things with that. Um, but like I said, I got hot sauce. Um, I got uh, some other sauces in the refrigerator that I might try to mess around with. Um, we got cheese. I might throw that in there while it's cooking. Um, the ramen noodles. I got signature sauce for McDonald's. I love using signature sauce for McDonald's. Um... I got honey mustard, which is my stuff, bro. I love eating everything with this. It's the best. Um, we got some other stuff that I really don't mess with. We got honey. Uh, but right now, we might just use the honey mustard and hot sauce. But yeah, guys. Um, so what you want to do first is like... Oh, yeah. And I got this little thing. So like... But this isn't going to be used in this video, I don't think. Um, but anyways, guys, like, let's get on to the video. I'm just waiting for these pots to heat up. So, let me switch my camera. But yeah, guys, like, here we are. This is the hot plate. No, don't mind the mess. Here's my Coleman, by the way. Don't mind the mess over there either. Um... But like I said, we got hot sauce, we got carrots, don't mind my dishes over there either. Uh, we got some honey mustard, which I might put on the hot dogs as they're cooking. But, so, what I'm going to do first is I think I'm going to put the hot dogs on here first. So, let me cut those up real quick. Alright guys, so I got the ramen noodles in the pan now. Um, I'm going to chop these carrots up. I still haven't done that yet. And then also the hot dogs, which I don't know what I did with those, but yeah. So over here, guys, over here, I got some cut hot dogs cut up. Um, I need to cut some more up because I don't think that's going to be enough for this. Um, and I need to cut some carrots up. So I'm going to grab these and then that's what the noodles are looking like right now. Hoping this turns out well. Um... Uh, but yeah, I'm about to try to cut some more hot dogs and then cut some of these carrots and we'll, we'll be, we'll be on our way. Well guys, the, um, ramen noodles are done. We got the hot dogs and carrots cooking over here. Um, they're not quite as done. I should have put all of this down at the same time. Um, but I'm about to put this hot sauce on there. And also some honey mustard. So let's do that. Um... Okay. Get the flavors going in it, you know. B 
but yeah, you guys want to just try to like mix the sauce in there. I've done this quite a bit of times with different sauce. Um, the skillet, all you need to do is uh, when it's like when you're done with it, just like try to wash it so it doesn't stick. So there is that. Now let's throw a little bit of spice in there. Actually, no, let's not. I don't really... I don't like putting hot sauce on stuff that much. I'm not really a hot guy. But we did put honey mustard on it. So... But yeah, guys. And then, um... When it starts to look golden... That's when it's done. Uh, you want to try to get that sauce mixed in, though. You know, into the... But, yeah, get it moved over. Flip it, you know. So that's probably just about done. Let it cook for a little bit longer. So guys, um, this is done now. So we're going to take it off the skillet. We're going to go and take it in here into my dining room. So guys, then you want to try to just, oh, alrighty guys, this is what it came out looking like, it looks pretty good I would have to say, but uh, yeah guys, um, you guys can definitely make this at home, you don't have to use honey mustard, that's just what I did, but um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, if you did, hit the like button, share it with your friends, family, and associates. Don't forget to be PR Test. Don't forget to be the PR Nation. And don't forget to be a Rex Riley. I'm going to take a bite of this real quick. Tell you guys what I think. So. Get a good. All right, here we are. Mmm. So good. Yeah, guys, but, um, I don't know what to call this. Call it. I don't know. What do you guys think I should call it? Um. B C L. B C L. Balloon or. No, not a B C L. What am I talking about? H C L. H C L. Hot dogs. Carrots. No. H C N H C N A honey H C N Alright guys So this is my new recipe Honey H C N And I hope you guys did enjoy this um, Episode of Cooking with Riley If you did, hit the like button, share it with your friends, family, and associates Don't forget to be here to test, don't forget to join the PR Nation Don't forget to be a Rex Riley I'll see you guys in the next video Deuces